Hello everyone, welcome to LearnNowFX and today I will be showing you how to transcode mp3 audio into .wav audio. And it's actually very simple. So first we want to look at our song and here it is in our music folder. And remember the name of the song because it will be important later. And um, it's better that you don't have any spaces or caps lock, any capital letters inside the name of the song. It just makes it easier to work with later. So here is, I just have it called song. And if we go into properties, we will see that it is .mp3 file. And what we want to do, we want to convert it to .wav. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to take this audio file. We're going to copy it. We're going to go to Windows C. And we're going to go to Users. Then we go to the main user. And we are going to paste it in this, in this folder. Now, what we want to do is we're going to go to we're going to go to the search bar over here and we're going to type cmd and this is the short shortcut for the command prompt so what we're going to do is we're going to open file location we're going to right click and we're going to copy it and now we're going to go to desktop and we are going to paste this here i've already done this as you can see here it is at the moment that you paste it you're going to get a desktop icon that looks like this so i'm just going to close this so what you want to do you want to open ffmpeg using the desktop icon so just double click and what we want to type is ffmpeg dash i now you want to as i told you you want to remember the name of the file so in our case, it's song.mp3. Now we're going to type spacebar song.wav. So what we're going to do is now is we're going to click enter. This is actually a very good way to get started with FFmpeg. FFmpeg is a open source software that lets you, it's command line based and it lets you transcode audio and video from one format to another is very useful. So we get all of this message here and that's basically it, we're done. So I'm just going to show you what we want. So we're just going to type exit and there we exited the program. Now we're going to go back to Windows C. We're going to go back to users, to the main user. And as you can see, we have two songs here. We're going to click on the first one. As you can see, this one is mp3, that mp3. And the second one that we just created is WAV. That's about it. It's that simple. So thank you everyone for watching this tutorial. If you like this tutorial and you want to see more like it, please subscribe, please like. And if you have any recommendations, especially with FFmpeg or DaVinci Resolve, Fusion, anything, leave it in the comments below. I take a look at it and hopefully I'll be able to make a tutorial to satisfy your requests. Thank you. See you next time.